Okay, we'll go to Shelly on line two. Hi, I was just listening to the person that was talking about, um, oh. or I guess you guys were saying how... Um, I'm laughing at my floor, man. I'm sorry. Is what, um, can lead a person to be the way they are, and I disagree. I believe it has to do with free will. Um, what do you feel about free will in a person who is a Christian or non-Christian? We... Uh, there's, there's, I mean, environmental factors. Many people are molested as children and right. they become molesters. Many people are children of alcoholic parents and don't. I believe human beings are beyond animals for the simple fact they have free will. Well, they have self awareness and a higher level intelligence than uh, any other animal. I, yeah, uh, I, well, intelligence can hurt you. <laughs> the point I was trying to make there is uh, uh, our, our position on Earth is no more uh, exalted than any other animal here on this planet. Uh, they deserve every right to be here. And uh, present uh, information I've been reading is that we spend 40% of the caloric output on this earth right now is going towards human beings. There's no other time in, well, in the earth history that any other species has controlled this planet the way earth does, the way humans are controlling the earth right now and we're not doing a good job about it because of the religious influence well okay now my question is though if you look at the civilizations that are no longer um, all of them have done things that have caused them to be destroyed and we as humans today once again are going to do that again uh, and yes. if you don't have something some kind of hope you're repeating your your history we haven't Our changed we haven't civilized become civilized in the true meaning of the word. The the uh, desire to survive, believe me, is very strong in me. And, and I want the civilization to survive. And one of the scariest things to happen in my lifetime, and, and I've had some scary things, but one of the scariest things was when uh, Pat Robertson was making a run for, for the yeah. presidency. A man who believes that uh, he has a role to play in the end of the earth, mm -hmm. the end of civilization. Now, uh, I, I realize that from a religious person's perspective... Uh, I'm not religious, I'm a Christian. Um, a what? difference. <laughs> very, no, there is no. a very big difference. Okay. There really is. Oh, you must, we're, we're running out of time, but I must hear the explanation quickly, please. What's the well, difference between a Christian and a... Well, believes in Christ studies the teaching of Jesus. The, a no. person who's religious is like a Pharisee or a Sadducee, a person who just wants the power. But I would say that if, you're, if, if there is any supernatural existence in your belief system, you qualify as a person who is religious. Well, I disagree, but thank you.